Hi guys, so they always have sales, so here you go. Hi guys, so today I am talking to you about my circle bottle. So we got these, um, my husband got one first because he wanted to check it out to see if they were good, if they were worth the money, you know, all that. Well, he finally got me mine. Um, he ordered it a while ago. It took a little bit to get here, but it's around the holidays, so you know, everything is slow. Anyway, I have this pretty per um, pink one. It's the 22 um, inch one um, because I didn't want the 30 some odd one because it's too big for my hand and David has that and I didn't like it. I didn't find it comfortable. Okay, so the one I have in here is this like it. It is, you know, pina colada, but they just call it coconut pineapple. And this one is really delicious. I went ahead and tried it last night. I just searched out the coffee one for one of these and I happen to have an extra one. Anyway, you can, so, um, their bottles range in prices. Like you can get a plastic one or these metal ones. I'd recommend the metal ones, but uh, for price range, they have like small ones for like kids. The plastic ones start at $12 and then, um, they go up to, I think, 35 Um, I can't, I think this one was $30 for this 22-ounce metal one. And I chose the pink. You can also get sleeves to, for them. I didn't know that, or I would have. Um, they're like $12, and you can get them in a variety of colors, just like the bottles come in a variety of colors. And, yeah, I think it's a good deal. They always have really good sales, like... When I went on there to check prices, it said I could get 30% off of my bundle today. And these little guys are about $3.75 a piece. Um, it lasted me quite a while yesterday. I think it's still good. Um, it really probably just depends on how much water you're drinking. But I know my husband can go through one of those in a, in a day of, at work and stuff. Um, so I'm not really sure how that works. But anyway, oh. Let me show you what I was doing. Okay, so, like, um, with these, you can adjust how much flavor you want in it. Let me see if I can. So, it's, like, right there. I have it set to two. That's perfect for me. I don't like overly sweet things. And I find that since these are fake sugar and stuff, if you turn it up too high, for me personally, you get that um, bitter fake sugar taste. I mean, I'm used to that taste, but other people might not like it. I mean, I don't like it. But I find if I have it at two or three, that is a good number for me. It makes the water taste good without being, you know, too sweet or, you know, oddly flavored. Okay, so this is the coffee one I put in last night. It's actually um, creme brulee, and it is caffeinated, so they do have caffeinated ones. They also have caffeinated fruit ones, I believe, and they have a couple of tea ones too, but I personally haven't wanted to try those because, um, I don't like instant tea. St oh, I forgot to put my water in here. <laughs> just a sec. I don't like instant tea. I think it's disgusting and I'd rather just brew some tea and it's easy to make sugar free. I mean, it's tea. You just add your like skinny syrups if you want a flavor and or just plain old stevia and some lemon. Okay. So I'm pouring my water in here. Forgot to do a minute ago. Okay, so then you take the thing you want to put in there and you shove it in, and then you, you know, you twist it on as you can see. <laughs> anyway, and then you know, I always open this top part. One thing I don't like about these is, for some reason, and David said these lids are new, um, when I go to take a drink, I'll take a drink, and then I'll close the lid, and the next time I go to take a drink, there's water in here, and it always pours on me. I find that kind of gross and annoying. Anyway, if you want water, you would keep it, oh, hold on, you would keep it on this, that's an X, I don't know if you can see, and over here is, it points to water, so you could just drink regular water. If you didn't want any flavor, and then this side, the other side is where you do the flavor. So I'm going to put it on two because I do want some flavor. One, two, and the coffee ones might be different. Okay, so I'm going to try this for you because I want to know how the coffee tastes too.
on this one. I need to turn it up, but I didn't really taste that. Also, sometimes it might take a sip or two, you know. <laughs> Turn it up again. Okay, it's on four now. I forgot what number it goes up to, but I think it's like six or nine or something. Okay, that's good. Yeah, that tastes pretty good, actually. For paint sugar stuff. Anyway, I definitely think the bottles are worth it. Um, if you can't afford it, because it can, I mean, I personally feel that 350 something for one of these that could possibly only last you a day or could last you a few days um i like to get a lot of water and so i haven't been able to test how long they last but that can get expensive and i know they have sales all the time so you could probably get a you know they can probably be affordable and um so if you can afford it it's worth it if not i'd suggest just you know getting your regular bottle of water going to your local grocery store and buying the flavors i know um we have a winco here and the flavors that you pour the powder flavors that you pour into your bottle of water are only 88 cents i mean you only get five but if it's what you can do that's what you can do but if you can do this i highly recommend this more just because you get the whole bottle and i mean it could potentially last a while. I, I'm not really sure. All right. Anyway, so that is the deal. And I will see you guys later. Bye. Attention! Hey, boy. Mm. Okay. You all level the shoe. I'm getting tired. Look at the chin to the nappy. All I want. Hungry to die last. So high. I don't see you. You talking to just get I kill it. Me and I spit like a villain. But I'm not a villain. 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 I'm not a vill